Hey everybody, what we are going to do right now using the viewfinders that we made in the previous video, I think it's like two videos back, I'll see if I can link it, we did homemade viewfinders. Now I'm going to use these viewfinders to move around this old painting I have of the wooded landscape behind my house. <clears throat> I made it months and months ago. I'm going to use the viewfinders and move around this painting to find smaller versions of paintings that I like. I'm going to isolate areas of the painting that I find interesting with the viewfinders. It really helps. Um, I sprayed the back of the painting because my initial idea was to use them for collage and I didn't want harsh edges. So um, you can just ignore that step <laughs> unless that's what you want to do. I wanted the edges to be a little frayed. I couldn't find my exacto knife so I had to use these scissors. But I'm using both shapes, square and the rectangle, to find interesting shapes. I end up with four. Four patterns that I pull out of this old painting that I decided to do abstracts of and I've started on those I have two completed actually I'm gonna say I have one because the second one I wasn't happy with them I have to re-record and repaint but anyway I have one ready to go for you guys but this is the process of me getting there and then I glue them down and I number them one two three four they're gonna be like an abstract series once I'm finished or that's the plan but this is something you could do um, with your viewfinder find an old painting that you don't care anything about and pull out some new paintings from that one okay you guys have a great and wonderful day and i'll see you later bye